The Georgia Institute of Technology, commonly referred to as Georgia Tech, is a public research university located in Midtown Atlanta, Georgia. Requirements to be able to attend Georgia Tech is you have to have at least a GPA of 3.95. The tuition is $12,204 in-state and $32,396 out-of-state. Georgia Tech's main campus spans 400 wooded acres in the heart of Atlanta. The campus is comfortable, yet a stimulating living and learning environment, with virtually every amenity close at hand. Georgia Tech's graduation rate is 82% and has a 32% acceptance rate. If you're like most college-bound students, you have an image for what you want in a college experience. Excellent reputation, challenging academics, innovative programs, first-class facilities, stellar faculty, and an exciting campus environment. Georgia Tech is a school that is known for its excellence and a school with very many successful students. Georgia Tech is a university that can make you successful in life. Give it a try. Hi, I'm Ellie Gies here with our new Athletes of the Week. So first of all, congratulations to all of you. Can you start by telling us your name grade and what sport you play? Okay, hi, I'm Andrew Pakowitz. I'm in 10th grade and I play tennis. I'm Mary, I'm a sophomore. I'm a junior and I swim. I'm Maddie, I'm a senior and I play tennis. I'm Jonah Bosselman and I'm in 10th grade and I swim. And what goals do you guys have for the season? So last year the boys team, the boys tennis team was state champions. And this year, uh, we lost a couple of seniors, but we're still looking to have a good season and um, hopefully getting as far in the state tournament as we can, hopefully getting to finals, maybe getting another championship, but we'll see. Yeah. So I want to win state with the girls team, and then I also want to get a best time in my 100 breaststroke. Um, I think the girls tennis team, my goal is to win four state championships in a row, so that should be the goal. I'm hoping to place well in state. Um, I'm swimming on three relays. And how are you guys working to reach those goals? So right now the boys team is we're trying to really figure out our lineup and the beginning matches this the beginning matches of the season and really try to get all our new freshmen um, adjusted to the team. And uh, we're also working hard in practice. Yeah. I've been changing up my technique, especially on my pull and my turns, to get more power. Um, lots of practices in doubles and in singles, so yeah. Practicing three times a week and working on uh, relay stunts. And what is the hardest part about your sport? I'd say the hardest part about my sport is how individual it is and how it's just, it's not really it's kind of all up to you on the deciding point. There's a good amount of pressure. The consistency that you need. Um, I would say the same as Andrew, like when you're on the court, like by yourself, it can be very intimidating and you can get really nervous, so yeah. Yeah, definitely keeping consistent with the times and making sure to um, keep in shape. And what is your favorite part about your sport? My favorite part about the sport is probably playing on the high school team and um, uh, cheering on my other teammates as we play. Definitely the feeling that you get when you get out of the pool and you know you've like given it your all. Yeah, um, my team and getting to hang out with all my girls, so yeah. I love the competition and, and getting to swim on relays is really exciting. Thank you. If you see these students in the hallway, be sure to congratulate them. Kobe Bean Bryant was born on August 23rd, 1978 in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. He spent his early years in Italy and was selected by the Los Angeles Lakers right out of high school. In his second season with the Lakers, Bryant was voted a starter for the 1998 All-Star game, becoming the youngest All-Star in NBA history at 19 years old. Kobe Bryant was also named the 2008 NBA Most Valuable Player and was a two-time NBA Finals Most Valuable Player winner. Kobe Bryant played in both 2008 and 2012 Olympic Games with the United States basketball team. Additionally, he won consecutive gold medals alongside teammates Kevin Durant, LeBron James and Carmelo Anthony.
on April 13th, 2016, Bryant dazzled a sold out crowd at the Staples Center and fans everywhere in the last game of his career, scoring 60 points and leading the Lakers to a win against the Utah Jazz. It was Bryant's sixth 60 point game of his career. On January 26, 2020, Bryant was on board a S 76 helicopter that crashed in the Los Angeles suburb of Calabasas. Nine people, including Bryant and his 13 year old daughter Gianna, or Gigi, died. We miss you, Kobe Bryant.